What's up everybody, if you that don't know me, my name is Chris, aka Mr. Grow It, and you're watching my extras channel. I've got an unboxing and a short walkthrough for you today. This is the Gove Wireless Thermometer and Hygrometer. This one is actually Wi-Fi enabled. They do have a different model that is Bluetooth enabled. Basically, this unit not only tells you what the temperature and humidity is when you're standing next to the unit, but it also includes an application that you can download on your phone, and you'll be able to see what the temperature and humidity is through the app, as well as set up alerts. And we're going to walk through that a uh, little bit later on in this video. Uh, first, let's start with the unboxing of the unit. So as you can see here, very nicely packaged. In this separate box right here, there are a few pieces to where you can assemble into a stand or you can use one of the pieces as a wall mount. And I'll show you how to do that in a little bit. This card right here has a little bit of additional information. It gives an email for support. So if you need any support, you can email them. And it shows what their social media is as well. And lastly is the user manual. Okay, so my cat Stella has decided to join me. She's pretty interested in this as well. And in order to get it to function, you basically just pull out this tab in the back and then as you can see, the unit has uh, turned on. Now I'll remove the clear plastic film. And the unit is now operational. You can now see both the temperature and the humidity. Okay, so I'm gonna quickly unbox one more of these. They actually sent me over four units. I personally have multiple grow areas. So I'll be using this device in uh, four different areas actually. And on this one, I'm gonna actually place it into the stand. So you can see here, I'm assembling the stand. It just simply slides in, super simple. For now, I'll place this one on the floor of my grow space. Typically what I'll do is I'll take a canopy temperature reading. I have my sensor push hung at the canopy level right now, but I may eventually switch it out. On the other device, I am going to mount it to the wall. And I only need one of the pieces out of that separate box, not both of them. So the piece that the unit actually slides into is what I'll be using. And then I'll take the 3M double-sided tape that is provided in the box as well. And then I will stick it to the wall. Okay, now we'll go into the app and we will do a quick walkthrough. So first, of course, you've got to get the app. It is available on both iPhone as well as Android. So I just downloaded the app and I now have it open. I just click the top right corner to start. You can see that they have several different pieces that are compatible with this. It's not just thermometers, hygrometers. You can connect LED strip lights, copper wire lights, LED bulbs. Uh, they've got other lights and also additional smart home accessories uh, such as they do have like a smart plug, water leak detectors and so on and so forth. Now the app is asking me to sign in. I actually need to sign up. Uh, this is the first time I've ever used this. Okay, so after signing in, I am going to add in the two devices. So I simply find the device on the list and click on it. Then it's gonna actually show which devices are nearby. So it can detect the units that are on and you can simply click them to activate them. Now it's asking to hold down the button on the device for three seconds to sync it all together which I'm doing right now. And as you can see, once it's synced, it actually blinks. It gives the opportunity to name the device and then you click done. Now I'm adding the second device, doing the same thing where I just basically find the device on the list, hold down the button on the unit for three seconds and then it all syncs together. All right, so in the app, it is gonna show the temperature and humidity as you can see here. It's actually one of the devices is actually selected at the moment. And you can change this from uh, Fahrenheit to Celsius. You can also look at the data in different ways, whether it be look at it for the day, look at it for the week, month, or year. I obviously don't have any data yet since I just activated the device, so it'll take time for that to accrue. Going back to the main menu, you can see both the devices are visible there. And then browsing around to some of the different menu options, uh, here is where you can add more devices, uh, like I talked about a little while ago. Here's some more things, uh, miscellaneous things in regards to their community. And then here there are different profile options that you can change. Let's click back into one of the devices and let's set the temperature and humidity ranges. So as you can see here, I'm setting the temperature range. First, in order to activate it, you need to slide over the alarm me. And then when we go back into the main menu, you can see that it does actually show what the range is right there on the home screen, which is pretty cool. Again, a link to this product will be in the description section below. I just wanted to do a quick walkthrough today to show you guys what it's all about. 
What do you think of this unit? Let me know in the comment section below. And I'll leave it at that. Thank you so much for watching, and until next time, peace.